How's it going guys? Lian here and welcome to another architectural video or rather a not so architectural video. So for today's video, we are going to do a draw that random thing from your memory challenge. More specifically, we are going to draw random buildings, structures, castles, forts from Lord of the Rings movie. So what I did a while ago is I wrote a bunch of buildings from Lord of the Rings, put it into pieces of paper and then crumpled it up and I put it inside this hat. So what we are going to do is just shake this hat and pick a random building from Lord of the Rings. And uh, alright, we got one. So the one we got is Rohan, alright. Rohan. So in order to draw Rohan properly and you know somewhat architecturally, we are going to use the famous perspective hack technique. It's probably not famous. I'm probably the only one who knows it. In order to do this perspective hack technique, I'm going to show you guys a really, really quick video how to do it. So here are the materials that you are going to need. You're going to need two strips of center board, some long strips at around one centimeter width. And then you're going to need a few strips of vellum paper, two pieces of thumbtacks and some masking tape and two small binder clips. Now here's what you do. Place the thumbtacks on each side of your paper so the thumbtacks are going to represent your vanishing points. Place the strip of vellum paper on top of your thumbtacks and then we are going to attach that to our Sintra board strip. Now that that's done, let's put our tiny binder clip on top of that so that we don't accidentally poke our hands on it. So what this does is these two Sintra board strips is going to represent our guidelines from the vanishing point. So back to the drawing process now that you guys know how to do the perspective hack. So yeah, we are going to draw row hands. So Gosh darn it guys, let me just close the door. So as I was saying, first thing we are going to do is draw the hill. Basic shape for a hill. And then we are going to draw our Rohan castle on top of that hill. So I'm going to purposely position our horizon line beneath the central point of our building to make Rohan look stoic because you're looking from down upwards. We call this view a worm's eye view. Usually in olden times, castles would have this like huge tower so that they can see the enemies, the orcs coming from afar. So let's put the tower in the middle. Now that we have our basic shape of Rohan, let us begin crafting our environment.
So in olden times, they used to add bushes on sides of stairs because in case you fall down a stairs, you land on a bush. Okay, that wasn't true. I just invented that fact up. <laughs> I just wanted to put bushes on sides of stairs. Alright, I think we're done with our Rohan picture, man. So let's go check what Rohan really looks like. That's what Rohan vaguely looks like. And this is our Rohan. Anyways, I guess I'm going to end the video right here. This video is probably an hour long already. I hope you guys like this new video thing I'm trying out. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I will see you on my next video. Flying peace!